Spider Fisherman International at the Thordon Bearings booth, and I'm with Scott Groves. Scott, it's great to see you. Thanks for coming. Appreciate great. it. Great. Tell me about Thordon. You've been in the hydroelectric business for how long? Well, Thordon Bearings has been selling hydroelectric bearings since uh, the middle 1960s. Is that right? Um, we've been serving uh, main guide bearings, wicket gate bearings for the last 40 plus years. And this year, our parent company, the Thompson Gordon Group, is uh, enjoying our 100th year anniversary. Congratulations. Yes. yes. That's great. Something we're quite proud of. Well, your booth looks tremendous here, and you've got all these products. I'm anxious to hear about uh, the products and, and services that you offer. Okay. The first thing that I'll talk about today is a new material that we have. It's called Thornton Thorplast. Okay. It's a very stiff, rigid material yeah. that we've brought into the market to handle higher pressure applications, up to 4,500 PSI in limited motion, 6,000 PSI peak static pressure. And it's what we brought into the market to specifically look at wicket gate applications, uh, spillway control, radial arm gates, things like that, as opposed to our main guide bearings, which is more of our core business. Okay, so it's expanding what you have to offer? Exactly. We're trying to offer our customers solutions for all of their bearing applications and not just uh, the, the hydrodynamic applications that we would have really more looked at in the past. Okay, okay, great. And then what else do you have? This looks really well, this interesting. Well, is, this is part of our new, uh, I guess, more innovative technologies. This is something that we've really gotten into in the last couple of years. It's very cool. Okay. And what this is, this is, a, this is a standard water lubricated main guide bearing. They've right. been around for a long time. long time. But the major difference with this one is we've been working with a few environmentally conscious uh, power producers who are taking water lubricated bearings and converting oil lubrication bearings over to water lubricated bearings. Okay. Which, it's, it's quite a big step because with an oil lubricated bearing, you'll have a bearing lubricated by oil with a seal underneath to keep the water out and the oil in. Okay. And what we look at doing is taking the seal from underneath the bearing and putting it on top of the bearing. We bring a clean water flush just below the seal, forcing the water down through the bearing, and it removes all risk of oil pollution. And These days of environmental is, consciousness, absolutely. sustainability. We can take that issue. potential headache right away from, from a customer's worry list. Now the second thing that we've done is we've taken this tapered key set, which is something that we've, bor we've borrowed from Thornton's extensive marine experience. And what this key does is that it can be pulled with the bearing housing still in place. No cranes, no heavy lifting. Okay. And once this key is out, these bearing shells relax in the housing and you can pull the bearing shells, you can do measurements, you can do maintenance, you can replace if need be, and you can put them back in in a matter of hours as opposed to days. So and from a maintenance standpoint, that makes a lot of sense Absolutely, for it's safer, it saves tons of time, and obviously time is money. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, we're, we're quite excited about this. Uh, we have many uh, applications in our, our uh, engineering department right now. It's been a big hit with our customers. Yeah. Well, it does sound like, speaking of applications, there's all kinds of areas that your products can fit into a hydroelectric project. Absolutely, from wicked gate bearings to operating ring wear pads, to main guide bearings, to segmented shaft seals, to uh, the operating linkage bushings as well, flow control I mentioned earlier. If it moves, we're interested in looking at it. I like that. Okay, Scott, tell me, if I'm watching this video, mm -hmm. where do I go for more information about Thornton Bearings? Uh, www.thornbearings.com is a great place to start. We have all of our brochures there. We have key contact lists in our company. We also have a lot of great uh, success stories uh, and references that are published on the website as well. It's a great resource for our customers to go and visit and learn more about Thornton Bearings. Great. Thanks for sharing with us today. That was very interesting. All right. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome.